Hey, what is up? Matt Goldberg from Stocklock Masterclass. How are you doing today, guys? This is a great subject this week that I want to talk about, and it's a question that I have been asked quite a lot in the last few months, especially from people that are just coming into this business. And it's the subject of payment terms. I'm getting a few people saying to me, I, I paid 30,000 euros to, to um, someone and I never got my stock. I give terms, okay? I give payment terms to all my customers. And you know what my terms are? Payment up front. Yeah. Payment up front. Before you get the goods, you pay me 100% up front. That is normal in our business. It's, I've been doing it for the last nearly 30 years. Everyone, every, anyone who understands this business, they'll know, you know, if you want a deal, if you're looking for a deal and you want a good price on a deal and you want to get people down on price, the only way to do it is by offering 100% payment up front before you actually collect the goods. If you're selling to someone, it's payment up front. That's it. The only way, the only credit terms you give are obviously if you're dealing with like the big high street retailers, which obviously they, they always want some payment terms. The big high street retailers, you know, the ones that have two, three, four hundred shops. They want 30 days. Some of them want 60 days. I know a few that want 90 days terms as well. Guys, I don't deal with those people. I, I won't deal with those people. They want 30, 60, 90 days payment terms off me. And they want to try and get me right down on price. If they want to pull my pants down and get a cheaper price, they've got to pay up front for the stock. Simple as. But, you know, a lot of the other discount retailers, both here and overseas, they all want stupid credit terms. And they want to nick the stock from you cheap. They want to nick it off you cheap. So, you know, you're not getting much profit out of the deal in the first place. And they want to pay you in 30 to 60 days. No, forget that. Anyone who really wants that stock will find the money to pay you up front. So there's three ways of doing this. Now, now a few a few of them are, I will do to regular customers that I've dealt with for years. You know, I know them. The first one is, is one that I do with most of my customers, which is payment before delivery. Or if they're collecting the goods, they pay me 100% payment before they collect the goods. And that's it. Done. If there's any issues, I sort the issues out with them. If there's any, if there's a slight shortage or if there's some damages, I sort it out. I look after my customers. I want to do more business with my customers. Um, so another one which, you know, I, I will do sometimes if it's a, an established customer, but not if it's, you know, if it's someone I've not dealt with before. Payment on delivery. You deliver the goods, they unload the goods and count them and check the stock, make sure it's all okay. Then they pay. Then they make a bank transfer to you. So that's payment on delivery. The third option is payment before loading the goods. So this would apply to if you've agreed a deal with a customer and the deal is that your customer collects the goods. They collect the goods from where the goods are, what, whatever location that is. So they will arrive with the truck and they will pay for the goods and then they will load the goods onto the truck. So that's payment before loading. You got payment before delivery, payment on delivery, payment before loading. So that, those are the three options. You, your priority one is payment before delivery or payment before collection if they are collecting the goods. So they're the three options. If you've never dealt with someone before, don't, even if they've sent you photos of the stock, in the warehouse so just pay up front for the stock and then sit waiting for your delivery you've never dealt with them before don't pay up front for stock now the only way you would and i do 
I, I do pay up front for stock to companies I've never dealt with before. However, the difference is these are these are real legit companies. They're proper companies. They're manufacturers or they're importers. You know, they've got a big presence online. They're a proper big established company that I'm dealing with. Well, the ones I'm talking about, if you're buying stock, say from a from another trader or a broker overseas or wherever, you know, there's a lot of traders and brokers. Like I say, the ones that don't use a proper email address, you don't know who they are, you don't know you, you don't know anything about them at all. Don't pay these guys up front. Don't pay these traders up front for stock. Pay for, pay them either on delivery or go and meet your truck at the location and oversee the loading of the goods. So turn up at the location with your truck. Meet your truck there and or your shipping company, whoever you've used, and you say, look, these are the terms. I will pay you. I will turn up with my truck. I will pay you for the goods and then I will load the goods. Um, or deliver, deliver the goods to me and I will unload them and check them, make sure it's all perfect and kosher. And then I will pay you for the goods. Don't just pay some stranger you've never dealt with up front. I've just, I've seen some stories over the, over the last few years. There's guys coming into this business and they're paying up front for stock from a trader that they've, you know, they might have spoke to on the phone, but they've never done any business with them. They don't know anything about these people. These are guys that are just with a, a Gmail address, email address, and you don't know who they are. You know, they've got no website. They've got, they, there's just, you've got no references. You, you don't know anyone else that's dealt with them. Use your head okay use your head three options you pay up front you pay before delivery okay only if it's a reputable company that you've checked out okay but listen if it's a trader that you're buying off or a broker or you know some um some guy from um from who knows where that you don't even know oh ever 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 pay up front for stock pay for the goods on delivery or go with your truck meet your shipping company at the location and physically see the stock being loaded and then pay for the goods or pay for the goods and then load the goods okay as long as you're with the stock that's fine don't get robbed okay don't get robbed i see it too many times in this business there's so many guys just paying up front for stock. I mean, listen, people deal with me for the first time, even traders. And of course, you know, what am I going to say to them? Don't worry about it. I've only been in the business 28 years. You'll be fine. I don't mind if someone wants to go and see the stock or pay for the stock before they load the stock. That's fine. Okay. Most of the time I'm dealing with guys online. And they pay me up front and they don't even know me. You know why? Because they check me out online. They see I've got a great website. They, they see I'm on here. They see I'm a real guy doing business. I'm established. You can see that I've been in the game a long time. I'm out to look after people. And that's how you should be. However, there's some people in the game who they're out to screw people. So do your homework. Firstly, don't ever pay uh, a trader another trader up front for stock okay never pay up front for stock to a trader say to them i'll pay on delivery or i'll come and collect the goods and when i'm there and i can see the goods i'll pay you and then we'll load the goods that is my advice on actual paying for stock um or how you know how to deal with customers or the other way around when you're buying stock. I want you to have a great week. Remember to click on the link below, join my Facebook group. And also if you haven't got my free video on how to source and buy highly profitable products at under factory prices, please click on the link and get your free copy. I will catch you soon for another great, great video. See you soon.